Oh my fucking god. What a night it's already been. So I've had uh, two of these beers. Uh, I went to the store and I bought some beer that looked sick. And I didn't look at the alcohol content of this beer. It just looks sick. And it, and But uh, now I'm reading the fucking label of this beer. And it says uh, 9.5%. That's the... That's the... beer oh so hopefully we'll get a crack on this as well this is a bottle not a fucking can shit and also <laughs> and also I just got done watching the fucking Final Fantasy 15 stream <laughs> I swear, I almost fucking pissed in my chair and it just rolled off like a waterfall. I just, I mean, there, I, I, there was so much saliva on my screen as a result of that stream. <sighs> I have work at 7 in the morning tomorrow. Okay. <sighs> also, I found out fucking Rogue Squadron came out today on Steam, so I'm going to be playing that because I remember the Nintendo 64. Fuck yeah! Play the music, son! It better need those, cause I'm gonna be slurring all over the place cause I've had two beers that are fucking 10% alcohol! Star Wars is, is really good. Oh, no, why is that there? Why is that there? Fuck you! Fuck you! Why is that in here? Get that garbage out of here! I don't want that. It's never go. It's like Mr. Plinkett said. They're never gonna go away. They can't ever be undone. They'll be here forever. I went from like 10 to negative 50 in like three seconds too bad you couldn't take bigs with you dude listen to sick tunes i remember this not being terrible i like it oh shit i used my petite torpedoes no wedge why why is the camera fucked up okay i don't i don't think we can play i'm gonna have to figure this out and do this another day which is really unfortunate because i was so excited to play this video game yeah, R2, just keep squeaking and boofing around. Ah! Hobby just does most of his thinking on the inside. You never hear from him unless he has something absolutely crucial to Two say. fighters against a Star Destroyer? Why couldn't they fucking get fucking actual Luke to do all this shit? He's a voice actor. He was. I mean, think of all the shit that, uh,. Yeah, like, I don't under- I fucking don't get it. Like, fucking- Like, think of all the stupid dumb shit that Mark Hamill did voice acting for and they couldn't get him in fucking Rogue Squadron and shit? Mark Hamill will do any voice acting for- I'll call up Mark Hamill right now. He'll do voice acting for me. He'll- he'll do a night of, of drinking and playing video games for me. I just gotta pay him some money. It ain't that hard, dude. The thing is, I haven't played Mass Effect 3 more than once, and as long as I just keep forgetting that that's a real thing, I could probably be okay. If I just keep playing Mass Effect 1 and 2 and just pretending that 3 isn't a real thing, I'll probably be able to live my life in contentment, but if I play Mass Effect 3 again, I'll probably just piss on myself until I drown in it, and then I'll have to just like... As I'm shitting, just kind of crawl out of the room and then fall down the stairs a lot until I'm dead. Remember how you were tricked and how you were like, think you thought Mass Effect was good and you were playing it and you were a kid and you got super obsessed with it. Remember how you played, you were so sick and hyped for Mass Effect 3, just by the last time you got tricked by games, you were kind of in high school and you were starting to understand how video games are marketed to people and then you fucking. You were, you, but you still held out for Mass Effect 3 because you liked Mass Effect a lot for no reason. 
And then you 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 played. Uh, just hold on. Drink to set yourself up. Uh, and then you played Mass Effect 3, and you were still hopeful, and you still had a good time in the game, and the gameplay was okay, and the story and characters were still good, and then you finally, you know, got everything, all your shit together, and you're ready, you're like, fucking, we're going to Earth, bitch, and then you get there, and it's the sick, awesome trailer shit. And, you're like, and you feel like everything's gonna matter. All that shit you you said, all of those choices, like just the little things. Did you kill that guy in one, or did you not kill that girl in two, or how many people you left, or like the fact that you killed Thane, and the fact that Morden died, and all that kind of shit. Just all those people you killed or didn't kill, or all the the fact that you loved Liara and then secretly you cried when Miranda died in, in 3 because you liked her too because the R wasn't there yet and all that shit you just, you just love you're just like sick all this is gonna come to a head you're gonna somehow somehow magically gonna know how to write in all of that shit and then you get to that end point and there's the three fucking choices and you just sit there and it's just you have to pick one of the three and there's no time Thing, no time limit. It's just pick, pick whichever one you'd like. Would you like, would you like red, blue, or green? Pick a color. It's your favorite. But then he, whichever one you pick doesn't even matter either. Why did I expect better? And it was the last time you were tricked by a video game that something would actually be good as far as story. Wow, a lot of shit's coming out. A lot of realizations. That was the last time you got tricked. It's fucked up. Don't get tricked by a story. Don't ever think a story is be will be good. Go into everything that you've ever ex ever seen, expecting it'll be bad, and then be surprised or just be like, yeah, it's what I knew it. Like Star Wars Seven, I went, I was like, yeah, it's gonna be terrible, and I enjoyed the first half, and then after that, I was like, oh yeah. This isn't good. And then I remembered, I was like, yeah, I didn't think it was going to be good. I was like, yeah, it's okay. Or go, just go into everything expecting it to be bad. Go ever, go into anything expecting it to be the worst thing ever. And then either you'll be like, yeah, this is okay. Or like, I like this one part. But don't ever be disappointed again. I remember, I'm, I mean, I got disappointed probably five times. And then I was like, yeah, just don't, don't do that ever again. Just expect everything to be the worst thing. And then if you're surprised, it's okay. Say the- okay, fucking- Say the same thing eight times, and then maybe somehow someone will, will be able to be able to deal with that. Fucking put a video game up, stop put- I mean, I hope you just put stupid pictures up that somehow relate to the story of this shit. Okay, if you're in the alcohol store and you see this sick beer, and it says 9.5% on the bottle- don't buy it. Don't do it. You didn't even play Rogue Squadron. You've just been talking. This has just been you talking a lot. And talking about Mass Effect and how... Because you think that's going to be anything! <laughs> Don't add to the spit on your fucking screen that costs more than $400. Jesus Christ. So what type of... Why can't... Look at his eyes just fucking going nuts. Like... Imagine all the things he's got to look at. Like, there's just like 18 billion tits just <laughs> poking at him on the other side of the screen, and he's just got to look at all of them all the time. That's what's happening. You know how pants, they got to be like brown or blue or gray or black and not stupid colors? Do you know about that, or? Shut the fuck up! No one gives a fuck about any of this! Remember, Remember how the G36 was supposed to be so sick and it just. Gentlemen, we've got a delicate you know how all these, like, uh, gun companies keep coming out with some new shit, and it's just literally just like, look at our pr 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 proprietary weapon system, and it's not modular, and it doesn't fit in with anything that you currently already have invested in. And people are like, oh, okay. 
And also, I imagine all the people who just don't give a fuck, like even you when you're editing this shit, and this does not look good anymore. What Holy shit, who this? holds Our that low on their dark, fucking gun? But we have on their handgun. Who holds this, this low and just kind of keeps all the gun above their hand? The don't put your thumb thumb up or thumb forward, don't get any good grip on the gun, just kind of hold on the bottom part of the handgun and just hope for the best. <sighs> the thing is, is that... <sighs> <laughs> this alcohol is way too potent for me, for my little baby face. Ow. This has been a pathetic night, and if I drink anymore, we're going to have some serious problems, and I just finished the beer. So I think the only course of action I can take is to just fucking quit, and this, I hope, I hope you're you're happy with yourself and i hope that that final fantasy stream gave you all the pleasure it needed because it sure uh, if you ever want to have some fun go watch that full final fantasy 15 stream and just think about people who said this is a good idea